Hello! So I know a house tour has been pending and I've been wanting to do a tour. So I thought today, why not do it? Because, you know, we cleaned up our place, our few friends are coming over. Usually it's not, you know, the tidiest. So I thought today I'll take you guys around and show you my apartment. Okay, so let's start at the entrance. This is how you enter. It's the hallway. We live on the sixth floor. You enter into the apartment. It is how it looks like from here. That's the door. That's the kitchen. This is the living room. That's the bathroom. And here is the bedroom. So the kitchen came with, you know, dishwasher, fridge, oven, microwave. And yeah, there's storage unit one, two drawers here, and here and here. Um, as you can see, there's not as much space. I mean, I can't even reach those stuff. So basically, it's left us with only like a few cabinets. Next is the living room. I absolutely love how much light enters into this room. We actually have this bar area and we decided to buy two bar stools from Amazon, which are like $100. I'll link that in the comments. And we've created like a bar area. We usually do work here, but sometimes the friends are over. We uh, mix drinks and whatnot. TV setup that we got from someone in the apartment and the TV as well. That poster there, I've had it since freshman year of college. So funny, I used to like think about it and be like, oh my gosh. Maybe one day I'll live in New York, and there you go. I live right across the Empire State Building. I actually got this couch for $30 from uh, someone who lives in the apartment. It was broken on the side. We just decided to take out the hardwood that was broken, and now it's like a fully functional couch. But the craziest part is this couch is $60. But that chair that I'm gonna show you in a bit, that ended up costing us $200 because I was just like, oh, this chair would be like so cute. Um, and it's like the most slippery thing ever. Like I sit on it and I'm like, I, I don't even like fit well, you know? So it's crazy that like that chair was 200 bucks. This sofa was 60 bucks. This table is also from Amazon. We decided to get these cute plans to make it look you know, a little artsy. Best part of the apartment, of course, is this corner unit situation. We record videos here. I sit and work here sometimes, but the views, ah, oh, I love it. And from here, the apartment looks like this. And we have another window here. View from here is like this. Let's go to the bedroom. So this is the bedroom. As there's a bed, super cheap. It was, I believe, like 30 bucks for this bed. Converted from Amazon. The pillow thing also from Amazon. There's a wardrobe here. So here is where you can keep your stuff. This is where I keep my stuff. And this is right next to the bath. bathroom next. We just put a mirror here. We have a, you know, bathtub standard bathroom i love the lighting it's good lighting there's cabinets behind this so you can store stuff uh but yeah something i hate is this is so small you can't put your brush and stuff so we just have to put some of my like nighttime routine stuff here and the brush is actually here so there's that so that was my apartment you guys uh, i know a lot of you guys also have questions around how I found this apartment, how you can go about finding an apartment in New York, which are the areas to live in and what are like good price points. So I will do another video or like another few videos actually addressing these questions and um, giving you like the spiel because I want you guys to save as much time as you can because obviously like moving to New York City is not a simple ordeal. Like there's so much that goes behind the scenes before someone actually gets that like perfect apartment and I really do want you guys to find a perfect New York City apartment if you guys are planning to move to New York City. So I will be making videos on that. So on that note, see you guys in my next video and like always like and subscribe. Ciao!